enjoyed the book since I was a child and they've been an inspiration to me in my illustrating career. Undeniable impact of that particular body of work can be felt, I feel, across the whole of children's books right now, especially um, in the in the sort of sector that has anthropomorphic um, animals as main characters, like whole worlds build up around that. Like you can see the scary influence in all of that stuff. And it's just undeniable, man. It's amazing. If you've never seen Richard Scarry's work, please seek it out. Um, please share it with your children if they've not seen it. Fantastic drawing, fantastic characters, really good fun. The first books I can remember really loving were Richard Scarry's Busy Town books. Um, and this was because I didn't speak English very well um, because I came over here when I was six and the great thing about his books is that I didn't need to understand the words um, because he had put so much story into his pictures. I'm a big fan of Richard Scarry's perpetually busy roly-poly characters make adult life intelligible for children. And my abiding memory of Richard Scarry books was actually getting my um, long-suffering grand to make us what we used to call hunky-dory sausages which were based on Hunky Dory from Busy Busy World. He packs his books with wonderfully detailed illustrations. I think what he'd done um, on each page, having like a zen-like quality of chaos, um, lots of juicy colours, um, and animals doing things that humans do, was really, really, really amazingly fun to watch, um, watch when as a child. Um, and his work still influences me to this day their humour, their detail, their joy to look at um, over and over again. And, check this, my first ever quote on the back of a book. Yay! Anything is possible in Richard Scarry's imaginative world. Really cute, and I love his work. It's such a, such a fantastic legacy. It's great stuff. Thoroughly recommended. Thank you, Richard.